Welcome everybody out there in your homes all over Australia and the world. It's a truly international event and we're so thrilled to welcome our presenters and guests from across Timor-Leste, Kenya, Papua New Guinea and more. The programs that they're going to talk about really look at very important issues of maternal and child health, TB and infectious diseases and poverty related hunger. What these programs all have in common though are that they focus on improving the opportunities and the lives of some of the most vulnerable children in the poorest parts of the world. We experienced 10 times newborn mortality rate here in Timor-Leste compared to Australia. To stop these deaths, we need to educate communities and change attitudes about childbirth. We train volunteers who work in remote areas running health promotion sessions. They encourage and refer women to go to the health clinic and checkups. And just know that your contribution will put a smile on a mother's face for her lifetime. $100, thank you, Di. Nina um, has said $200, please. Nuri, $100. Karen Ford, $100. And uh, lots of joy. It's coming through thick and fast. And look at how wonderful already. Catherine said, this is truly moving. Thank you, everyone. Di, Marina, Chris, superstars. And indeed, this feels good when we do this together. I wish I did not have to search through the dump site to feed my siblings. These were the words of Jacob, a 12-year-old. Jacob's father is one of 1.7 million Kenyans that have lost jobs since COVID started here. Child Fund has a program that is specifically focusing on addressing the health and nutrition needs of the children. I think with the support of agencies and people like you, we are optimistic we can overcome the, pro the, the COVID problem. I pledge $100. Thank you very much, Angela. $100. Thank you. Thank you very much, David. Carla, I pledge $50. $100. Thank you very much, John. Laureen Simon has texted that she will pledge $500 to support five households for a month. To that, I would love to add $1,000. Thank you, Kay Wilson. And it's nearly 3 a.m. Hi, Morgan in the US, but I've so enjoyed every minute of this event so far. $150. Thank you, Simon. How exciting. And Nelson has said, wow. When my son Daniel was 13 years old, he nearly died of tuberculosis. Thankfully, Daniel survived. Every year, more than 7,500 children catch the disease. Together, the TB treatment supporters and the regular outreach clinics are helping us eradicate tuberculosis in Papua New Guinea. If we continue this work, you and I can end tuberculosis in Papua New Guinea. $500 from Joe D'Antonio and love to my friends from Child Fund Korea. Chris Dwyer will pledge $2,000 to buy 200 bikes for treatment support workers in PNG. Housley Communications, $1,000, incredible. $800 in the names of the six Sheehan and the two Ramsey sisters. What a good team you are. Okay. Just received some great news. We've had a pledge of $10,000 from Aaron, and we are so excited to announce that the company he works for will match his pledge, making it a total of $20,000 that will go towards all three countries. Oh, how did that happen? <laughs> that is incredible. A massive clap for Aaron Moyes and the company he works for, IMC Foundation. Just let us uh, feel that. It is incredible. What incredible generosity from our whole child fund. Thank you. We really did achieve something special tonight. I hoped that we would, and I think that we did from the bottom of my heart. I, I want to say thank you so much for your generosity tonight. So good night and thank you a million fold. And until we meet again, thank you for your time, your generosity and your support. And for one of the great evenings, thank you. Please stay safe and have a wonderful evening.